Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome your faces back. This is Freshy and you are watching The Walking Dead. I hope you are all keeping well today. Um, I've just wrapped up that FIFA stream there now so we're gone on to episode 4. This is called Around Every Corner. So let's do it. I got myself a cup of tea. Um, some after eights. So I'm going to munch on them. Just kick back and relax. Um, I think that was actually the first time ever introducing myself as Freshy. Previously <laughs> on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly! Ugh, I've heard enough out of you! Now, I can't believe this happened. Bad out, like. You're not coming with us. No need for that. about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay and, well, if they're not, what happened to them? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! Ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need... Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. I love after H man. Ladle. This phrase or something? Oh, there it is. <laughs> right, so this will probably be two hours again. Two and a half hours to do this episode. Sometimes you just get really stalled on it, man. It was funny when we were at the train in the last episode and we literally did the steps to like unhook the, the cart behind us and then like we went to a cutscene that it didn't progress like we couldn't progress so we had to go back out to the cart and then come back in from that, that side again to do it. If you watch the end you'll see what I mean. Okay but we've arrived in Savannah now I think. We also learned that Ben, um, he was the one that was giving the guys drugs and stuff. What's going on, Al? Cheers for tuning in, guys. Be sure to drop a like on the video. Make that like button blue. I hope you're keeping well, Chili. Kick back, relax. Yeah, maybe we can get some search going on later, too. Just for a little while. We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can. Not now. I need you to yeah, mom. They're so good. On the street. Okay. So Sorry. addictive, like. How's Omid? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to <sighs> rest. He needs to rest. Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there. It sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Did you see Al Have that they're bringing the, the Last of Us to me. HBO? Kenny knows what he's doing. Gonna be on TV, bro. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, that's true, Andy. I got greedy, you know. Maybe you know what I'm like. Not so dead after all. <laughs> Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. Mm. On a timer. What do you do for breakfast? Bell goes off at twenty past the hour. Munch, munch, munch. Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you, there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! Yeah, man, I know. I can't wait, How Andy. Are you? It's gonna be so good. I'm gonna go I back and play um, the first work. one, I think, in the next couple of weeks and stream that too. Hello? Hello, are you there? 
Oh man. <laughs> You're hearing from me now, man. What are you talking about? What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. I might hop on call That's after this time, oh yeah? Probably be done this around nine or something. About? Maybe half nine. Yeah, a bit of search would be nice. Yeah, he was. He was in Game of Thrones too. He was the guy that fought the mountain with a stick and then bat him and then got cocky and then the mountain squished his head. Spoilers, sorry. Everybody, run! <laughs> the running animation in this is gas. Wall bang. Diddy! Oh shit. I'm too busy eating. A little too close. Don't Smooth. Think. Oh no, Clementine! Ben, you absolute. Oh, we're finished with him. I'm gonna kill him. Oh shit, man. Oh shit, my aiming. Jeez. Stop swinging. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> yes, old man. Thank you. Man, I thought I messed that up. He is a legend. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's last, not all. Last one. I'll give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? No! Ah! Grab him, Chuck! Shit, he's in trouble! We gotta help him! Yeah, we should help him, right? There's no time! We gotta go! Now! I'll be fine! Just go! Chuck is a badass, man. The controls are so awkward, guys. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit. Was he bitten? We've got to get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Just get us inside. I don't care how you do it. Maybe you should come up with some ideas then. <laughs> Shut up, you. I'm gonna slap him around for leaving Clementine. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Never leave a man behind. You this put is... that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's, it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely <laughs> doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck. At least not with me. Yeah, that last episode was tough, Probably man. For the best. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. Okay. Do we talk to Clementine? See what's up for her. You think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? Try not to worry. Even if they saw us, console, relax. Why can't they? We're a lot smarter than they are. They're just like dumb animals. They can't open doors. We used to have a pet hamster. One night, he figured out how to open the door to his cage, and when we woke up, he'd eaten half a box of cookies. Sure, it's fair play to him. I don't think this is quite the same, Clem. Yeah, right. This time, we're the cookies. <laughs> Just stay away from the gate, and we'll see about getting us inside the house. Okay. Talk to these two saps. How's he looking? I'm all right. 
You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. She's just worried about you, man. Don't worry. We're gonna get you fixed up in no time. Just as soon as we're inside, okay? Okay. Thanks, man. Please go and help Kenny. We need to get him inside now. I'm on it. Just sit tight. Hey, he's just looking after you anywhere. first. Right. Help Kenny out with the door, maybe. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. No way we're gonna force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. Hey, how you holding up, man? Lee, I appreciate the interest, <laughs> but I don't think talking about my feelings right now is gonna help us get inside this house. <laughs> How's it coming? Find a way in yet? Door's locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Hmm. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. You think maybe someone's still inside? Nah, we'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. There's nice gotta be a way in. Up. Wasn't there a person Just on the roof, figure remember? Out how to get in. Maybe you should have a look around. See what you can find. Right. Figure something out. Shovel. Thank you. The shovel is never not useful. Nothing we can dig. Look at that vent. Thirsty enough to drink that yet. I think I want to start digging up God knows what until we find our way into that house first. Just mm. a dog house. Right, so we're not going to dig that up. It's just a dog house. There's nothing else. I can't go that way. Um. Okay. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. What's the other item I have in my inventory there? Is that a hammer? No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. <laughs> He's just saying it every time. Um, what else can I do, guys? I literally don't know what else I can do. Talk to Kenny. Making any progress on that door? We're we are annoying the fuck out of him. What's this? No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. There's a little like calf flap. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor a doggy has door. Like it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to ah, it. Ah, the dog has been buried. Shit. Every day's a school day. That's exactly what All it right, is. So, where's the dog? So, we are going to get the collar from the grave. Clementine's going to go in and open the door. S case closed. Hey. Be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. Oh, what's buried down there? Doge. Poor Doge. Is he zombie Doge? Whatever it is, it's been here a while. You I can smell it from here. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me in Omid. Let Lee work. Poor fella. Oh god, the smell. <laughs> right, we just need the collar. Don't bite me. I can't get it off. Okay, that is not cool. 
Are you okay? I'm fine. Honey. Yeah, it's not great now. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're? I said I'm fine. Okay. Maybe she's pregnant. Right, can I take the shovel back? Maybe not. Well. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Uh oh. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. No, we need Clementine. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Nice. Then, are you okay? Say something. Nice. Ta-da! Legend. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. I didn't want to give out to her. She did good. It's okay from here. Everybody used in. her own initiative. Smile, what the hell, nice, man? Babe. Creepy dude. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least oh, I picked the wrong pro wrong decision, man. was on the radio. I think they were trying to help us. They did warn us, didn't they? Maybe you're right. But whoever it was, they're watching us, following us, mm. and they don't want us to know who they are. I can't think of any explanation for that that would make me feel better. Mm. Can you? I'm with Kenny on that. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head to the river together. Deal? Suit yourselves, but I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. I think Kenny's right. Get a boat, get out of there. The place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need Cheers to for sharing the stream, by the way, Al. Right, Retweeting it. You and me will take We're the legend, Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen Omi need anything, okay? Okay. Right. Have a little look around. All empty. I'll definitely be on for some card though, I think, after this, man. 
Nothing. Water's off. Hmm. Get that bag there. Bag of food? I'm not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. Was it dog food? What did it say in it? Oh, it is dog food. Hmm. No power. No power. What's the dog's name? Walter? <laughs> no food either. All cleaned out. Hmm. Okay, so we can't go around that way. Where did he say he had to go? That's the backyard. I don't want to go near that. The clock, man. Make sure that clock is off. Must have stopped working a while ago. Bottle of whiskey. Probably yep. Not the best idea right Proper now. twelve. I need to stay frosty. Proper twelve Irish whiskey. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Okay. How's it coming? Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet. What's going so far, on? So good. How are you, Nurkan? Nurkan Yilmaz, what's going on? How's that couch treat? Cheers for tuning in, buddy. Be sure to yet? drop a like on the video, right. subscribe. It really does help me out. We're on the road to a hundred, man. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. What do you guys think about this plan of Kenny's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's I your friend and all, Kenny's but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Maybe potential girlfriend with this with this woman? Oh no, sure she's with Omid. Ugh. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. I'm on a clam. Right. Some photo albums and stuff. Was th this was a church, right? Exactly. Yeah. My style. Or was it? Oh, there's Walter. Oh, the dog is so cute, man. Right, we'll have a little nosy in here. Got my Glock out. Nothing hiding in here. Disgusting. My Colt forty five. All clear in here. Just one more to check. Okay. Anything? So that's the back door. That's the stairs. All right. Last door. Fuck's what sake. Happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. 
Is he okay? Yeah, now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? The dog. Oh, just dog <laughs> and there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying mm. to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. It's dodgy in there. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee! Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Oh no. Oh no. Where is Kenny, Kenny gone? He heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Oh no. Stay here. Kenny gonna kill us or something? Uh, excuse me. Kenny? Oh no. It's probably the family. Kenny. You okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? No. Oh my god, man. Oh, that's the kid, man. That is so sad. Oh shit. Just a bag of bones. Kind of looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the Where's the parents, man? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here, starved to death. Jesus Christ! I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it, like I did before. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. Right, aren't we? Here. This will make it clean and quick. What are you doing? I thought you said you were going to take care of it. Oh, I'm sorry, I... Sorry, man. I, I don't know that I can. <laughs> oh, shit. I don't know that I can either. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't mean to give him the gun. I thought it was taking the gun off him. Yeah, I'll, I'll take the gun back okay. then. <laughs> I'll take care of it. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I'm going to do it. No, wait, you do it. No. <laughs> Shit, I don't want to shoot him. I'll just use the knife on him or something. Empty water bottle. You probably died of dehydration before you starved. Damn. What a way to live. What a way to die. It's just pretty dark, man. Um, sorry, Chief. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. This could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. Do I step on him? I think so. I don't, sorry, bro. Or does he get the wrench? He might get the wrench. We'll go to the boot. Jesus Christ. Christ. Sorry, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh my god. We should bury him. We're stepping out of the mate, I'll though. Take care of it. The mate. 
Poor chap. Bury him with the dog. Mister. Ewan Walter. Jesus. Tough gone. Do every shovel movement. Go on. Krista. An emotional start to the episode. I wonder what way it's going to end. Keep going. Oh my god, that actually scared me. Someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What is it was it a matter? man, obviously. I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm Kenny's fine. having an awful time, isn't he? Ruckus. Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers yeah, are it's, one thing. It's very the dodge. Someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Oh, I wish I had more after eights. Find ourselves a boat. I don't know if we'll meet well enough to move. Crazy, man. You better get ready because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us down. <laughs> Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the no, river. No, we cannot take you. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know it. It's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Hmm. Okay. Daylight's burning. Maybe that was Gonna a wrong decision. Gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid I trust her, out. though. I think she she actually likes the kids, so. So you're just going to leave me on the bench here? 
Maybe we take this guy. That's not how it is, Ben. Yeah. We need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot him. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone. Hmm. We have to make sure Clementine's protected, so that's why we kept the extra body there. So me and Kenny are going out to scout. Right. Cool. Seems a bit edgy, doesn't he? Keep your eye out for Chuck. He might be waiting for us around here. Yeah, sure. There's that bell again. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. No, don't shoot. Keep the keep the bell going. I wouldn't shoot. What in the hell is going on? I hope they don't come this way. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for. <laughs> Good one. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my god. No. All the boats are gone. There's gotta be a boat. <clears throat> There's gotta be. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me! Yeah, but that was before we... Relax, Kenny. For effect's sake, bro. That's gone, man. In the scrap. This one might still be salvageable. The boat's fucked. Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh, yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell yeah, you what, if I'm I do. An expert opinion on American history or on committing murders, I'll be sure to ask. Oh, but that's a low blow, man. Shit to me. That is low, Kenny. Neck of you. I thought we were friends, but I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. <sighs> no butter. Cheeky. Keep out. Not exactly a welcome banner. Right, let's check this telescope out. Oh, I heard a zombie. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Oh, there's a zombie hanging right there. 
Oh my god, there's loads. What the hell, man? What the hell? Fuck. Is this meant to be some kind of warning? Or do something like this. Reminds me with the Morgan episode in the TV show. He had like a city to himself and or a little small town to himself where he had like loads of walkers on spikes and stuff. I'm not gonna shoot them. That would be just stupid. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Um gonna look around the shops. Can I go this way? I actually hear one. Is there anything this way, no? Weird. The controls, man, so strange. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Yeah, what the hell is that? We'll get a quarter from here, right? Someone already looted the place. So we need to get a quarter. Locked. Hmm. Yo. Happy diddly days. Just bash the thing in. I will have a little nosy around. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. I told Boats you. Crack beneath the water line was someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the? What the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Crazy, man. Right, what am I meant to be looking at? Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Hmm. No way that one's salvageable. No. Nope. Nothing but water. Not a boat to be seen. Nothing but water. Not a boat to be seen. No. What about this bridge? The Talmadge Memorial Bridge. Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started to fall. Sunken boat. Plenty of docks. No boats. Don't really see anything else. No sign of any boots down there. So we've already done that. I feel like that's it, right? Oh my the hell. Has he got a gun? Stand. He's right there in front of you, Kenny. Bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. Let's. We've got okay. two guns, like. You head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, taken by surprise. Let's do it. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. I think Kenny's gonna fuck it up. Jeez, he got over there quick, didn't he? I think we need to uh, 
we need to get this person. Two on one, like. Oh, he's ducked. What the? What? Oh, shit. Man, I thought I hit her. Or him, or something. No! Kenny! Clem! Clem? Please, don't hurt him! How did she... How did she get out? She's a badass. How did she do that? You're not from Crawford. Have you been following us? Following you? <laughs> Fuck's sake, Kenny. Kenny, don't! No, he's with us! Clementine saved our ass, man. Who the hell are you people? Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly? Molly! I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. It's Molly! Very large glass of vino. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No, I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. What's the deal with this Crawford place? Are you sure you want to know? Yeah, of course, look. What's the crack? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't, or can't, live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! <laughs> Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. We just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. Clem, what the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Meat started getting really sick. Krista and Ben had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there, I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Ah, Lee. Really? Come on. Because if it weren't for her showing up when she did, I would have beaten your brains out. That's debatable. Uh huh. <laughs> What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. While the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... I mean, I mean, kids? No, the children, they just forced to leave. Along with their parents. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Why? Like I said, 
Zero tolerance. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, pull their own weight. The way they looked at it, those mm. people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. Jesus. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. <sighs> Creepy. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? We're just trying to survive, same as you. And the only way we're gonna survive is by getting on a boat and getting the hell out of here. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You want to keep your voice down? Shit. It's Since a cool story, isn't it? Boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Oh. Right. Just right. Let's have a scrap. Isn't that the... Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? But is there a Thanks, Molly. <laughs> right. We're not gonna be able to do that. What the hell do you think you're doing? I'll tell you what I'm not doing. I'm not getting eaten. And what about us? What about you? Please, you can't just leave us. Go on, Clem. Puppy dog eyes. Come on, make it fast. Come on, come on, hurry! Everyone up. Come on, come they're on. so slow. Oh, One good jump. Oh my god. No, Just cruise, bro. Hurry! I'm cruising, it's grand. The zombies are so slow. I have loads of time. Loads of time, surely. Yep. Got it. And we go in the sewers. Brilliant. Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Oh, God. Shit. Is there anything on this zombie? No. Right, down we go. Gotta be somewhere can open. Right, down we go. That is disgusting, man. He gonna be stinky. Dead rat. Ain't touching that. Last thing I need is some god awful disease.
למה אתה למין לוק אתה? אה, שיט. אה, ויקרוד. I don't know what this is going to do, but... Okay. Good thing I'm out here, and not there. Seems loose. Oh shit. Oh shit. Shit. Go the other way, dude. Oh no, what am I doing? I'm not sure, should I turn, on, turn off the sound this way? So that that zombie goes back, right? Ah oh, shit. Fight him, hit him! Ah, uh, for Jesus' sake! <laughs> oh God! Right. So we need to get get in there. We're gonna turn this left. Don't turn anymore in that direction. Okay. This is probably you now where I'm gonna get stuck figuring out what I do. So this guy comes down here. Shit. So if I turn it right again. Won't go anymore in that direction. Can I go this way? Only. Surely you can open that. Nice. Now. This way. Oh shit. Um that should be enough to distract them all, right? And then I'm gonna go in here. Let them all go down. I should have counted how many there is, I'm not too sure. I hope that's them all. Okay. There's just one little dweeb up here. No! Oh Chuck! I must have tried to hide out down here. Poor bastard. Chuck, rip, Chucky. No 
has to save the last one for himself. You what a legend. God damn it. No, hell. No. Bad move, man. Oh, no, I'm an idiot. Why didn't I hit the other thing? The other zombie's gonna get me. Nice. Oh, I alerted the zombies though. Those bars are way too solid. I'm not gonna be able to pry these bars with this. Hmm. It's just a sign. Tis. Shit, it broke off. God damn it. That door is fucked. Can I still no, oh, maybe not. No way I could pick that up on my own. Broken ladder. Surely I can pick up the broken ladder. Looks like somebody saw the damn thing off. What else is there? Can't reach it. Hook onto it. What the hell? Sweet hidden passage. Interesting. Scavenge for some goods. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Can I take it? Hmm. Surely there's more stuff I can take, right? Okay, just going for door the door, I guess. Oh my god. Who are you? It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here... Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there? How was it? As bad as here? I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone Jesus. from Crawford ever showed us. Fuck off. Vernon, what do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. Uh-oh. You're really not from Crawford? No. No. I'm really I'm not. not. 
Tell well, us three times. We are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my <laughs> list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Fair enough. Sides, why should we help you? If you've got sick people here, maybe I can help. Our group has medical supplies. What kind of medical supplies? I don't know. All kinds. I'm sure there's something you could use. We'd be happy to trade some for a guide back to where we're staying. Vern, we need medicine. Joyce is in a lot of oh, pain. I shouldn't I can't have lied. see her like this. Maybe it's worth the risk. Maybe so. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be all right. I shouldn't have lied. Oh, I feel terrible now. <laughs> God damn it. He probably would have came with us anyway. It's quicker for us to go with him, right? Anyway. Clementine? Clem? You should never lie. What's going on? Molly? How are you, Nikita? Oh, hey. Cheers for you tuning in. Be sure Who's to drop this? a like on the video. Subscribe. He didn't tell you about me? Help me out. I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back. How are you forever. keeping? Who's the fossil? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. This would be a better place for them to stay, in fairness, this house. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. Oh, shit. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Bonjour. Oh, How you are you, Snake? I'll need to see those medical supplies. What medical supplies? Sava. Uh, sorry, Doc. Kenny's gonna and die? Oh, spoilers, Nikita. Well, spoilers. You just get better and better, don't you? I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure he stays alive you now. Have to don't help don't us. you worry. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Oh, Mead, honey, you're gonna. Oh, be Mead's all gonna die. So you a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Hmm. Clementine. Clementine? Yeah. Where is she? It's in here, study. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? 
Where's the parents from this house? Clementine? Anything... Anything of use in here? I'll have time to rest later. Thought there might be something underneath the cushion. I wasn't gonna rest. Have a look out this window. Maybe someone watching. Quilt's drawings, but where is she? It's an oyster on. Uh, can we close them? No, it's a cabinet. Clem, you in here? Can I close the window now? No. Oh. <sighs> Let's see. Bathroom. Clementine, you here? Have a look in the bathroom. Clem? Bedroom. Got time for that. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. Hello. What are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't and you go bug them? The neck of her, man. I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. Can't go there. Clementine? Okay, she's downstairs. I, I thought there might be st stuff. Um, I thought there might be stuff I could find that she might have missed. We'll just go down and get her. Clem? Clementine? Right, come on. Clementine! Come out! Please! Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Crazy, dude. Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... Hey, take it easy. I think you've had enough. To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly Maybe you were said right, there's Nikita. not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Fuck's sake, Ben. Where is she? Clementine, where are you? That's the bathroom. She could be in here. Doesn't look like she's in here. Is she in there? Maybe she's at the dog. Doesn't look like she's in here. She's not there either. Clementine! Maybe we're getting. You would have easily seen her when you were walking in there. I have no idea. She must be at the back, man. With the doge. Clementine? Clementine! Where the hell is she? Not in the mood. Not in the mood today. We haven't even looked in Most here yet. Don't think anyone came in through there. 
There's a vent. Yep. What the hell happened back here? So, am I able to open it? Uh oh. Ammo, ammunition, guns. Boat! We found a freaking boat, man! Kenny's gonna be chuffed. Whoa. I know, right? That is class. Yes, Kenny. Put the whiskey in the boat. Oh, thank God. I feel bad for lying to Vernon, though. But we had to get him out. taking Kenny so damn long. How hard can it be to look over a boat? It'll take as long as it takes, Lee. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. Yeah, we I got it. That's fair she's enough, don't she's a beast, man, as well. Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? I think Get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is she's not taking us anywhere. The shape she's in right now. Oh, Gas tank's no. empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? We should go back out on the street, see what we can find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. Assholes. Well, what about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Hmm. Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. We sneak That's in? Putting it mildly. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. <laughs> How convenient. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center. Jeez, I'm glad surprise. I did take them. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Nice. Actually, not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people can <sighs> use just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. He didn't, so, didn't seem to be too rattled about me lying. We're going to Crawford? 
We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? Yeah. I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. Yep. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? Don't be a pussy. We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? <laughs> Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Yep. I can't lie to you, Clem. Yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Potentially. Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. She, I did say that. Don't I come with you? I think we should take her. Okay, you can come. Like I imagine our parents are there. To stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. Probably a bit risky bringing a kid, right? Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Thanks. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? Not a frame. So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Oh, what the hell no. is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Come on, guys. Let's go. Hold up just a sec. Are you ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Cheers, bro. On the road again. Come on. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. <sighs> Remember the plan. We stay quiet. We stay hidden. And we stay together. We find what we need. 
and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Roger that. And that part about staying close, that goes double for you. Okay. Hopefully there's no snipers or anything around. Are we inside walls? Yeah, looks that way. Where is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? You disappointed? It's just strange, is all. Maybe they're gone. Over there by the door. Ooh. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, try to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. Me and Kenny. Unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. <laughs> As he holds the gun. What the fuck? Oh my god. They're all zombies? Oh no. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, fast! Ah, japers. Typical. What's going on, Orla? How are ya? Kenny doesn't die? I have no idea guys who dies or what's how is it gonna play out or whatever so it's my first time playing this so Fuck Fuck Do you think they saw us? Your guess is as good as mine. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. Yeah, we can get all the stuff we need. Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than our guards. I agree. Yep. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even Shut up, Ben. Them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Ben is so annoying. Bruh. Come on. I think I know which way to head. He's gonna... I got gonna... a bad feeling about yeah, this. Yeah, I was just about to say that about you, but... You're gonna get bit or something. <sighs> Excuse me. Just keep moving. Here. Okay. Everybody in. Wonder how this is going to play out. Hmm. Armory, sick. Figures. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? The armory would be nice to get open. 
here. Just give me a sec. Any idea where we could find a battery? Maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. What about the medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Why okay. should I? I'll make the run to the maintenance shed there. for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Sweet. Let's go get it. Wait, am I not going with her? What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, okay. Act before you know it. Take care, Clem. Stay safe. Um. The Georgia State flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Alright, let's just roll. Let's get this done. Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. At least we know what he looks like. Alleyway to the auto shops down here. You All coming right. or not? I've already been fired. They're worthless. Hmm. Can't open it without the Call Logan. Maybe there's a combination. Hmm. Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Where would the uh, the combination be? Hmm. No, we can leave that. Too bad I don't know the combination to any of these. Hmm. We must find it somewhere. It's to the alley, right? I have to go. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. Where the hell is Molly? Molly, you out here? Yes, I'm not going that way.
Is that so? Oh, shit, must be down this way. Okay. Why is she behind me, man? Fence isn't an option. No, certainly not. Hermans. This is the place I'm looking for. Yeah, it is. It's in here. Nothing. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out of here. Okay, so we can't go that way. I wish you could run. Can you walk faster? Oh, you can walk faster. Or one. I didn't even realize you could do that. I was walking so slow the whole time. Right, how can I... Surely I can jump on that, right? Ah, there we go. Should take my weight. Big jump. How are you going to get back now? Need to find something to maybe hold it. Oh my god. Leave him. He's mine. Where the hell have you been? He's a bit mental. What the hell do you think you're doing? It's dead already. I think you can lay off. Don't tell me what to do. You kill geeks your way, I'll kill him mine. Damn. Freak. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah. Partner. He ain't shit now. Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't hmm. breathe. Not a problem. Look what I found. Nice. Oh yeah, that'll work. Ah, come off it. Right, Molly, you take care of them. Come on. Come on, hurry up. How did he come back? Grand. Just don't Take a look drop around. in. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Thanks, bud. Right, so what do we need again? We need the battery, right? I think that's one right there. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. Maybe the car? Blinking. Must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Wait, how am I meant to get up here? Looks like it's the whole 
tools for the lift hydraulics. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. What am I meant to, uh, to do here? Is there anything here? Can't reach it up there. Right, maybe we have to go through here. It's locked. No way in. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. All right. Hydraulic hose. Why? I don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe Let the car down. To cut it with. Yeah, man, I know. Like, where's the thing, though? Is it on this side? There must be something on the floor, maybe. Maybe she has something I can grab off her. Something you need? Yeah. Or that hook. That uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda yeah, and I need, have been need the hookah. Together. Hilda. That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. Oh, <sighs> so not a scratch. And then I'm going to do this yoke. Shit, did I do the right thing? I did it. There we are. Whoa, whoa! That's probably not good. No shit! <laughs> I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! There's the yeah. battery. Finally something goes right. Thank you. Give me that battery. To the terminals. Still attached to the terminals. Oh, which am I meant to press? Yeah. I thought I tightened that. Got that one off. It's off. Yeah, it was bound to happen, wasn't it? Still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Okay, follow me. Let that thing go. Move your ass. I'm coming. Nicely, get up there. Great, now what? Roof. Skylight. It's shut. Uh, Shoot it out. Right, I know, I know. I pressed the wrong button. That is class. That hook. Sound. Okay. Take your time loading by. Okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. She is a badass. That is sick. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. There's no way. What did you call me? <laughs> I know I'm gonna fail this. I know I'm gonna mess this up. Oh, thank God. I got the aim right. <laughs> to be honest, I would have liked to have seen the fall. That would have been funny. Is that weird? A little bit weird, right? Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you've still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. I was never gonna See leave you without you. Ollie. Oh, Damn, she means on the boat. Hmm. Um. I don't think did we find any codes for that locker? I don't think we did, did we? Shell casings. 
Oh. Oh shit. To get the thing. Nice. Break the door with something. Come on, come on, get it closed. Later. Damn well better. There's so many of them. Yeah, that's a lot, man. It's a waste of a uh, of an axe. Not start high five each it. other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. This should be uh nearly wrapping up soon, you'd think. What are we we're coming up to nearly two hours? You're back. I yeah, think. And we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. Hour forty, maybe. How you doing with that door? Not so good. He is terrible. He's been after, at that for about hand. 30 minutes. You get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Um, yeah, I don't really want to talk to her. No way the hell that me. Look at the rug. Don't care. Look at the dolls, TV. Don't care. We'll get this open. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? <laughs> that was all in the one day. <laughs> no, wait. Was it not? There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ian, come on. This again? It's uh, my fault no. that Kacha got killed. If oh I hadn't no. Back at the motor in, they'd still be alive. How oh, he's gonna he, Ben's gonna die. Ben is going to, to die. 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 Ben, just forget about it. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real, He's gonna real. die. Maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. We need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself for the good yeah, of everyone. Yeah, at least till maybe next week. Tell him when you're on a boat I hear to you. Florida. I'm gonna get back to this. Right, do I have to look? Actually, I have to look Might at this show. For these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. No power. No TV. Um, alright, anything else? Looks like they had quite a system here. Crawford's final solution. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's see how she's you getting okay, on. Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. I miss school as well, man. It's not weird at all. So do I. You haven't been in school since forever. Hey, I'm not that old. And I used to be a teacher, remember? American history. Where's Molly? She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. Hmm. She'll be fine. I wonder how it's gonna play it out. A few, few of you have said Kenny's gonna die, and I think Ben's gonna die. I don't think so, Clem. Just rather be honest with Clem there. That we'll find a way to survive, to stay together, 
and to not let this change us. That's what's important. I'm surprised they haven't gotten this door open yet, man. This is ridiculous, like. Um, talk to, uh, we'll talk to this Yuna over here. Bree? No offense, but I'm not really looking for conversation. What's All right. Wrong? Nothing's wrong. I just don't particularly like you. <laughs> this is about Vernon. <laughs> She's racist. To, to get him to help us. I was only looking out for my people. And I'm looking out for mine. That's the only reason I'm here. So, if there's nothing else. Smell you later, Bree. Right, there must be something on that shelf, is there? Nothing you got a key or something? Paper. Maybe something on this? Some codes to... So according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office. And a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. Okay, that, that job's already been done, Lee. Door to playground. Right, that job has been done. Something on this, maybe? Hopscotch. Hmm. I'm all out of ideas of where I should be, um... Might come back for these later. Looking. Any reading material would be nice once we get... Any back. clues, guys? If you have any ideas, this room here. Let's ask them again. What, what are you guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. Guys, there has to be a key or some shit around, right? Creepy. Um. Hmm. I'm not sure where to look. Okay, well we can go back out. Let's go have a look outside. Let's see. Al, if you're able to look up of how to open the armory on episode 4 of The Walking Dead, that might be able to help us a bit. Hmm. There's got to be something lying around here. Exit to playground. Okay, well we can't open that, so this that's the hole in the roof. Vernon was down here, right? Let's go down here and have a look. Shit. Oh my god. Maybe we are meant to come down here. Vernon must be trapped in there. I can't shoot, man. Maybe that was stupid. Fuck it. Okay, that was well off the aim, but uh, we'll take it. <laughs> there must be a key to the armory in this here. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. None. Key. Looks oh. like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. Can we just guess the combination? It's a four-digit code. You do the math. <laughs> I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. Surely they did. It open. Has to be. Choice. Okay. You get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. There has to be a code. It's not, it wouldn't be on the bed. Look at the copier. Papers. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Hmm. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. Excuse me. And what's this? That's say like 8206. Phone. Phones probably haven't worked in months. How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. 
Hmm. Hey, Doc. Uh, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us and for all your help. I really appreciate Let's look it. around the house. Hey, don't thank me. Hmm. I'm not doing this for you. I'm doing it for my people. They need this medicine as badly as your friend does. Molly helped me get the battery we need. That's hmm. great. One down. Where is she? We'll keep searching. Took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. I'd say there's probably another with the battery? 15 minutes, maybe yeah. 20 minutes left. Don't worry, she'll be back. We'll figure it out. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. Uh, right, we'll finish it off the dialogue with him. You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Let's just leave it at that, huh? So, hold on. Was Omi uh, just we'll sick, is he? something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Um, what's on this file? Is this... Is that the way I came in? Hmm. Nah, man. There's got, got to be something in there. 100%. There's got to be more stuff in there. Open the door on both sides of the portrait in the living room. Nah, man, we're in a school though, Al. We're in a school, bro. There's no living room. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. Okay. I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. <laughs> I wasn't gonna rest. What's that? The sticky note there. Um, sonogram. This on the floor. It's a sonogram. Um, uh, camcorder. Oh, and they'll have a tape there as well. Sweet. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Doctor Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations. That's that guy that uh, Molly killed earlier. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, shit. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I could see old evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. Oh, I'm gonna no. give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I Hold want on, wait. Baby. Let's look I at his code for the fingers. I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. What's the code? Give us the code. It was almost there. Damn it. We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. We maybe there's another tape. We got to keep looking. Hmm. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Okay. Maybe you should search it. See what That's he's got on him. exactly where we're gonna go. Okay, so we need we need to speed this up, hey. So, do the old fast walk there, Lee. Come on. Hopefully I don't run into trouble there, it's that fast walk that we want. Zoom! All the way down here. Yeah! And all the way here. See, I think Molly actually worked for, um, worked with that doctor. I have a weird feeling, because she was so, uh... The way she killed him, like, it was just so aggressive or something. Um... Back down here. Hopefully, there's no. Um... Oh my God! 
Oh shit! Dickhead man. Thank you. What the hell happened there man? Right, where is he? Oh, he's going back. He's a crawler. Right, speedy. Stick move. Right, search him. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Hmm. Oh, that's the Shit. padlock in the locker room. Hmm. Okay. So we're going to have a look at this. Flying through it. Not a bother to us. We just hit the two hour mark as well, guys. Cheers for the support. Cheers for staying. Staying with me this far. Up to nine likes tapes. on the video, which is great. One of them is dated October 10th. I hope you are enjoying the day this. After the first one we watched. Put it in. I think Molly's gonna be on this this video. She should probably get kicked out here or something. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Come on. What was that? Oh my god. I didn't even see the numbers, man. <laughs> no. Seven, two, one, no. something. Oh. Jesus. He turns off the video as well. How did he put the tape back in his locker? More importantly, we got the combination. <laughs> like, imagine that's your priority. Like, you get stabbed and you're just like, here, I better put that tape in my locker. Krista, are you alright? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Alright. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Right. Zero, zero, six, eight, five. That didn't even look like antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much of this. What he as said, right? Or, or what he told okay, you? Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We yeah, we'll we'll have a nosey. That's all I care about. We'll Let's have a nosey at the, the tape, classroom. though. Don't take too long, Lee. I'm gonna watch the tape. We have to. There's something dodge on it. For sure. Come on. Watch the final one. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, Listen, shit. As as was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Overson had someone the down dirty dog, yeah. Inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. 
I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? He was a prick, didn't he? You can't do that and then not help her. Well, shit. Right, I'll be on me way. Let's go. Go back to this armory. Hopefully they have that open now. I'm not sure if we were able to have, have to find a key or something. Alright, let's go. Super fast. Super fast walk. Come on. Don't get stuck. Jesus there she Christ. is. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah, uh, about that. You better not I'm have just lost kidding. it. <laughs> Shithead. Here you go. Shound. How's your sister? What's that? Nothing. You lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before. But that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. You were having an affair with that doctor. Hey, from what I've heard, you're not real big on the truth yourself. Besides, I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but mm. you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. So she knew it was... started coming down. No one was it? couldn't justify their place a dead zone. in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. I kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just mm. wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Come on, before can we just get in the boat? And took my sister away. Get in the boat! This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? <laughs> She's pretty. You had to eye. get that in there, little doggy. Oh no, it's gonna burst open. Oh, Jesus! Shit. You fucking Egypt. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. You sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Come on. Ben? Oh no. Where did you get that? Oh just no. It. it was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no. You oh, idiot. <laughs> That's just typical, isn't it? She is a beast. Lee, shoot this fucker! Thanks. What the hell, it man? It wasn't me. Good going, kid. Nice shot. Nice shot, Clementine. She's a little legend. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come ben, on, damn you it. are the biggest idiot ever. This is my 
fault, all my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, we don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, we. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Oh, shit. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Oh, my God. Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. You gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pissant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! <laughs> My wife and child! You got them both fucking killed! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Come on, we gotta go, Kenny. Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. Ah, shit, We're I picked the wrong one. Together. We're a group. Sure, take uh, a vote. This is America. Fuck, fuck it. But before you I should have sided decide, with him. There's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, yeah. Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? Ah, oh, shit. Cut him loose. I'm sorry, Ben. I've got to do what's best for the group. And that means cutting you loose. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? <laughs> <laughs> You're not getting on the boat. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Now can we go? We should have left ten minutes ago. And then decided back at the gap. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Still Ben lives. Unbelievable. So much for the armory. What's left of it? Roy, come on. A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on, there's got to be a way out down here. Come on, lads. Just hurry up and get out, like. Oh, shit. Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Oh, for the love of Jesus. Shotgun. Nice. Hey, look! Oh, this is gonna be badass. Let me shoot. That's our way out. Surely. Oh, they're just gonna keep coming. Okay. That's bullshit. I shot about 20 of them there, man. Wait, what? What? What am I meant to do there, man? Okay. Select. Set your let. Okay. Ah, oh, for the love of Jesus. 
Okay, I can do this. It's just timing. Shoot the walker and then I'll shake my leg. Come on. Is there another one? Come on, bro. Thank God. Go on. Help me out here. Hatchet time. This is cool. Sick. Come on. Nice. It's all right, Claire. I'm fine. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think mm. we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! Go for the stairs, Lee. Come on, let's go! Ah, oh, shit. We're gonna attract so many. Why is it ringing? Surely someone had to have rung that. Ah. Uh, oh, that's the guy. Hold on, Ben. I've got you. Oh no. Oh no. Climb up. Come on, you can do it. There's no time. You have to go now. Oh my God. Come on. Let go, damn it. Get Clem and the others out of here. Lee. Come on, help me, Kenny. Come on, Kenny. You can't let him go like that. Lee, we both know. Oh my god. Let no way. Go. I don't want to let you go, even though you're a dick. Pull him up. Can't go like that, man. Go, go, go. Well, let Kenny kill you. <laughs> it would have been more. It would have been cooler to let him go and do like a dramatic fall, but no, we'll save him. Like, if we were able to do it, like, why not? Like, Krista, everything okay? Oh, me. Omid has gone to Bobo Town, man. Clem, stay back. Don't get any closer. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. Ah. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. Hey. <laughs> back already? We got you medicine. Good. I feel like I could use some. Savage. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Don't look at me like that, Guys, Kenny. What the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Cool. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. No bother. Hey, I wanted to thank you for all you've done for us. Save your platitudes for someone who's buying it. Huh? What? You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. 
Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now just hold on a damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here, and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you the kind of leader you are. They're not going to make it much longer. And what are you on a boat? Yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is going to solve anything. Now, you may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl. Which is why I'm going to make you an offer. Okay. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands. Take her back with me to my people. No. We're well supplied. Well hidden. Freak. And a lot of us have Gooey. our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. All you're a cancer survivor She'll group. Safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. I promise. Walk away, dude. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away, which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her, and if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation, but you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is oh. gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Vernon said that they're a cancer survivor group and that they're gonna be dead soon anyway. Like, what the fuck? Like, why would we put her in the care of him? Like, freak. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded. And I no, we need her, walk. man. She's a good fighter. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Oh. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know I will, she thinks man. the world. Everyone keeps saying that. Of course I will. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. She took the battery, did she? Now we have the battery, man. No, she didn't. We've got that thing. <laughs> she gave us a use. Hey, so gave us a pack of jura cells. And he's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? She probably did, man. She probably did, actually, yeah. Uh... Someplace else. Hmm. Someplace better. Graham, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Well, he's been through a lot, Clem. He's just gotten a little overwhelmed, that's all. I'm sure he'll be fine. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Don't think so. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. <laughs> Where will we ever find our parents? <laughs> What's he doing with his hand? Reach out. Give her a hug. Oh, I think I made the wrong one there. Tough gone. 
tough going for Clementine. You think so, Al? I don't know, man. I thought the battery might have been given to, uh... To, to Kenny. Clementine. He's always losing her. Like, what does he be at? Like... Clementine? Where she gone? Like... Alright. Let's move. Out the back garden, out the back garden. Clementine? Clementine! Oh no! For Christ's sake! Where's she gone, man? Maybe I should have helped her look for her parents. Shit. It's blood. Or it's just a shadow, maybe. What the hell? Did he? Did he bite me? Oh no! No, Lee got bit! No, 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 fuck. Lee? Lee? No. You out here? Lee! What are we gonna do, man? Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Show Clementine? It. She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. Oh, There's that's no stupid, man. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. And who the I hell should have went with her. Last I wonder what that still happened. Offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clint may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. Yep. Our help. Damn right. Let's get it. Let you do this alone. Nice one, Amid, my man. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Really. I can't believe Lee's gone. Lee, I'm gonna be gone. Man, you know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself, if this was me, asking you for help? Asking you to put your life on the line? Would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. What are you talking about, man? I've always been there for you. Kenny, man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I have. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. Well, maybe that's a good thing. Because you're on your own on this one. No way, dickhead. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. I swear, before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. 
Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon, see if he took her. Let's head out. I'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure I can wait there until you get back, or at least until nightfall. You're yeah, thanks, bud. Take me. Even bit. Yeah, we'll figure out what to do about that when the time comes. Come on, guys, let's go. Okay, I wonder does that wrap up the episode? Surely it does, because I'd say this is kind of a big journey to go into the next episode with, you know? There can't be more. Can't be. There can't be more than this. How long is this, man? Gone, no freaking way, man. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Earn it! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back, and nobody needs to get hurt. Hmm. Right. What's what's happening? Ah, oh, shite. Where are they all going? There's a lot of them. Oh no. Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Cody. Who is this? Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you. I choose my next words very carefully. Who is this weirdo man? Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh my! Okay. Penultimate trophy awarded. Um. You and 25% of the players killed them, so the boy in the attic. So others left them. Jeez, that's kind of weird. The, what does that say? Did you lie or threaten for it in you? And blah, 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 42%. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? Yeah, 55% brought her. Did you let Ben fall to his death? So 53% pulled him up. And 47 let him go. That's mad. Did you reveal your bite to the group? You and eighty-two percent showed the bite. Yeah, you were. You had to show the bite, man. Like they're your friends. Like you couldn't hide it. Who came with you? So you can get Kenny to go with you. You can get them all. Okay. So yeah, guys, that was episode four. Thanks to um, the four of you guys that stayed and watched. I really do appreciate it. Um, the next episode, I, I'm not sure if it's the final episode or not, but it's going to be pretty awesome. See what happens. Um, either way, Kenny, Kenny's on his way, or not Kenny, Lee's on his way out. Um, but what's, I'll be back again on Tuesday for more um, FIFA. 21 content and more of this so i'll see you all then guys um and i appreciate all of you staying and watching be sure to drop a like on the video subscribe if you're new take care guys all the best